Hi everyone, it's Adrian from Active Monash here. Hoping that you're all well, staying safe inside and not going out anywhere except to do those essential things. Today I'm going to take you through a Pilates class. Uh, you'll need a mat, plenty of room around you. We're not going to move around too much, but plenty of room just around you. Make sure that you have a bottle of water, a towel handy, and just enjoy yourselves. If you have any injuries at all, please take care. If you need to stop because of that injured area, just stretch out while we're doing this exercise. When we change, join back in. If you can do the exercise, but slightly differently, modify it to suit you and that injured area, that is perfectly fine too. I will be giving you different modifications anyway, so choose the modification that best suits your level. If you have not done Pilates before, take it a little bit easier, don't do too much too soon. If you've done lots of Pilates classes, you can take it up to different levels that will suit you. This is a core strength and stability class, so we need to modify, to, sorry, to, we need to engage the core, all these muscles around this area, by drawing the navel towards the spine throughout the class. I will remind you of that as we go through. Make sure you use good posture throughout. I'll remind you of that as well. And that's about it. They're the main rules. I'll tell you everything as we go through. Now I'm not using music today, so we won't have that in the background. If you'd like to put your own music on in the background, please do, feel free to do that. Okay, let's begin. Now we need to start with good posture, so we're going to sit our hips over our knees, over our ankles. Relax the toes so you're not digging them into the floor and causing tension up through those feet into the legs. Okay, draw that navel in as I said, and let's roll the shoulders back. And then roll forwards. Now lift your shoulders towards your ears and release back down. Lifting up and release back down. One more time. Now draw those shoulders right back and down. Place your hands on your hips and we're going to tilt forwards and backwards just through that midsection, keeping that core engaged. And then hold in the centre. So you're in neutral spine. You're not tilting forward. You're not pushing back. You're in that middle position. Arms beside you. Chin towards the chest. Breathe in. And breathe up. Round your spine as you roll towards the floor. Breathe in at the floor and then breathe out, roll back up. Now I'm going to give you a breathing pattern. If it doesn't suit you, use your own breathing. Breathe in, breathe out, rolling as smoothly as you can towards the floor. Breathe in and breathe out as you roll up. A couple more of those. Breathing in at the top and out. Scoop out through that midsection, let your arms guide you to the floor. And then rebuild that spine as you roll back up. We'll do one more of those. And coming up. Rebuild that spine, stretch it up by reaching up on the toes. And come back down. Okay, reach up and then we're going to breathe in and breathe out. Reach back. Breathe in, return, come up. Breathe out, reach back. And in one more time. Come up, take those arms down, out to the sides, and let's roll the arms from shoulder to fingertips and change direction. Hold, breathe in, breathe out, twist, and in, breathe out, twist, and in. Keep those hips forward. Come back down, arms beside you. And rolling again. Roll the other way. Okay, let's just come to the mat 
and just sit down. We're going into a mermaid pose. Now, we've got our legs like this. We've got our hips forward. We're sitting up tall, core engaged. Now, if you feel uncomfortable with your legs in this position, just sit cross-legged. Okay. Extend those arms out to the side. Breathe in. And breathe out. Reach over to one side, right on that side. Breathe in, return. And breathe out. Reach to the other. Now, you won't go as far on this side. And breathe in. Breathe out. Reach over, breathe in, and breathe out to the other side. One more each way. Well done. Come up, twist, take your hand to the opposite knee, other hand reaching behind, stretch. And then come back to the front. Well done. Give those legs a little bit of a kick out and swap sides. Now, if you're doing this cross legged, stay cross legged, you'll find it's even on both sides. Stretch out, breathe in, breathe out, reach over and breathe in, breathe out to the other side. So you won't go as far this side this time. Breathe in, out. And in, breathe out. And in one more each way. Hold, twist, take your hand to your knee, other hand behind and really stretch through that spine. Release, come back and let's kick out those legs. Great job. Roll the shoulders back and roll forwards. Coming up to the end of your mat now. Sitting up nice and tall, feet lined up with hips, knees, stay still. Take your arms forward and breathe in. Breathe out, roll back and sweep the arm to the side. And breathe in, return, sit up tall, other side. Breathe out, roll back. And breathe in, keep that core engaged. Again, breathe out. And in, sitting up. One more each way, up tall and then round that spine. Great job, hold. And let's lift both legs up. Place one arm on top of the other. Now, if you're uncomfortable with your legs lifted, keep them down. Breathe in. Breathe out, twist to one side. Breathe in, return. Breathe out, twist to the other. Breathe in. Keep that going. One more each way. Well done. Hold and extend the legs out. Bring them back up. Extend out and come up. One more time. Keep those legs extended and it's crisscross. If you need to support yourself, please do. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And last one, come up and give yourself a good stretch out. Beautiful. Okay. Roll all the way down with control. And relax there. Bring those feet up so that they're lined up with your hips, knees sitting over ankles. Arms relaxed beside you, drawing your shoulder blades towards your feet. Tighten that core, so switch it on and tilt your pelvis up and down. Then hold in the centre, so we're in neutral spine again. If you place your hand underneath, you've got a natural curve. Don't push it up to an arch. Don't try and get rid of it. Keep it neutral and hold there. Okay, breathe in, lift your arms up to the ceiling and then breathe out, split. Reach one above your head, one beside you and breathe in, return, swap them. Breathe out. Breathe in, one more each way.
Good job. Bring those arms to the ceiling, turn the palms inwards, shoulder blades pulling down. If you don't want the arms up there, please take them beside you. Now we're going into our shoulder bridge, so working from the lower body up. Keep that core switched on and breathe in. Breathe out, tilt your pelvis back, roll up onto your shoulder blades, breathe in. Breathe out, roll one vertebra up at a time, all the way back down. Breathe in. Breathe out, roll up. Breathe in at the top and breathe out, roll down. This time, as we roll up, we're staying up. Hold. Hold up there and take your arms over your head without lifting those shoulders towards the ears. Now, breathe in, lift one leg and breathe out, lower. Breathe in, lift your other leg and breathe out, lower, all without dropping those hips. One more to each leg. Good job. Now extend one leg, holding this circling from hip to toes without dropping those hips. Circle the opposite way. Hold. Breathe in, draw your knee towards your chest and breathe out, push out. Breathe in, draw in and breathe out, push out. That's it. Now one more time. Take the leg so that your knee sits over your hip and breathe in, lower the body without touching the floor. Breathe out, lift. Breathe in, lower and breathe out, lift. Excellent. Keep that leg out and then place it back down. Extend your other leg and stretch it out. Circle from hip to toes. Circle the opposite way. And hold. Breathe in, draw your knee towards your chest. Breathe out, push out. Now keep those hips lifted. Don't drop them. Keep them reaching up towards the ceiling. One more. Take the leg back so that your knee sits over your hip again. Breathe in lower and breathe out lift. Keeping that navel drawing towards the spine all the time. One more time. Beautiful. Keep that leg out. Place the foot to the floor and roll your spine all the way down. Come back to neutral spine, stretch out those legs. Give your body a nice long stretch. Doing well. Now from here, we're going into our roll up. So the idea is to keep the feet on the floor. Use that core as you roll up. If you can't come up without the feet lifting, just go as far as you can and roll back down. Okay, breathe in, unpeel, lift up and breathe out, reach forward. Breathe in, come up and breathe out, roll back down with control. Breathe in, roll up, lift and breathe out, fold that body forward. Breathe in and out. Keep going just as you are. Core strong throughout. Long spine. That's it. Working on flexibility here. One more before we add to it. Now if you're not comfortable adding, stay with this. Keep those arms long. We're going to make it a little bit more of a challenge by bending the elbows, fingers across the forehead. Breathe in, roll up. Always hard the first one. 
Breathe out, twist to one side. Breathe in, return. Breathe out, twist to the other side. Breathe in and out. Roll all the way back down. Control it. Breathe in, roll up. Up, tall. Breathe out, twist and in. Breathe out, twist and in. Breathe out, roll down round that spine. Use the core, keep it going. Now if you've done a couple of these and you think, no, I'm not happy with that, go back to those long arms. It's not easy. We have one more of these. Fantastic. Stretch out. Doing well. Remember, have a drink anytime you need. Bring those arms back beside you and bend your knees back up. To this point, we've been using neutral spine. Now we're going to lift both legs up, so lift them and gently tilt your pelvis back so you have a flat back now. Hold that position. Now we're going to breathe in and tap and breathe out, lift. Breathe in, tap and breathe out, lift. Press that back down. We are going to make this a little bit more of a challenge. Okay, hold. We're going to still tap, lift up your upper body. Now breathe in, tap and reach forward and breathe out, return. Breathe in, tap. And that's it. If you prefer to hold your head and do it and not use the arms, that is another option. One more to each. Great job. Hold, reach for the ankles, breathe in. Breathe out, extend your legs, circle your arms and breathe in. Breathe out. Now you can do this with your head on the floor. You can do it with one hand supporting your head, it's up to you. One more time, hold, extend one leg, take your hands to your head, we're going to breathe in and breathe out, reach, breathe in, reach and lift. Opposite shoulder to knee, don't use the elbow, use the shoulder. One more time. Great job. Hug them in. And then swap sides. Flatten the back, engage your core. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Last one. Good job. Hug them in. Now extend one leg out so it's just sitting above the floor. The other leg is up to the ceiling. Lift your head supported and just draw circles on your ceiling from hip to toes. Circle the opposite way. Hold there, reach forward and then over the head. So clap and clap, breathe in and out, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, bring the arms back, bend the knee, head down, hug that knee in, great job, okay, swap legs, extend the other one, so that just sits above the floor, support your head and circle, put the head on the floor if you'd prefer, Circle the opposite way. Hold still and breathe in, clap. Breathe out, in and out. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. Bend it in, rest your head and neck. Great job. Hug both knees in now. 
extend both legs up to the ceiling. Now flatten that back, engage the core, so draw that navel in. Now options with the upper body. You can keep your head down with your arms beside you. You can tuck your hands under your hips, always a good option. You can bend your elbows, palms up, or you can lift your head and support. Your choice. Okay, find that position. Now we're going to breathe in and breathe out. Circle one leg around. Breathe in at the top and breathe out. Reverse the circle. Swap legs. Breathe in at the top. Breathe out. Circle. Breathe in at the top. Breathe out. Reverse. Now keep that going. Don't move the hips. We don't want to rock from hip to hip. We want them to stay flat. Great work. Keep it going. Go. Doing one circle one way, one circle the opposite way. One more to each leg. Very good. Hold and reach. Let's pulse for eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and hold. Bend your knees, hug them in. From there, we're going to do both legs at the same time. So when you're ready, extend those legs. Now, if you want to change your upper body position, do just make sure that back stays flat, that core stays switched on. Okay, setting up. Breathe in, breathe out, circle outwards, breathe in at the top, breathe out, take them down and around, and breathe in at the top. Breathe out, circle, breathe in, breathe out, circle, breathe in, keep that going. Don't let that back lift, don't let those hips move. Doing a great job. We have one more. Excellent, hold and reach again. Let's pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and hold. Bend the knees, hug them in. Great job. Okay, taking those legs up again, keeping your back flat, keeping that core strong, we're going into a corkscrew. So head down this time, arms beside you, or bent up here. Don't lift the hips, don't lift the shoulders. Breathe in, breathe out, circle. Breathe in, go the opposite way. Breathe out, circle. Keep going, alternate those circles. One more each way. Excellent. Okay, crisscross down, crisscross up, down and up. One more time, all the way to the floor and stretch out that body, doing a great job. Now bring the arms back beside you and bend your knees up. We're going into our hundreds exercise, stable part of Pilates. Now, three things we have to do, nothing different, three things that we've already been doing. Drawing the shoulders away from ears, the back is flat to the floor, the core is engaged, so draw that navel in. They're the non-negotiables. These are the options. Legs can come to tabletop. They can go straight up to the ceiling. They can go on an angle wherever you feel comfortable. Or if you don't feel like lifting those legs off the floor today, you can do it with them on the floor. Your upper body lifts and you pulse two long straight arms 
from shoulder to fingertips, not the hands flapping, not throwing your body around, just like that. If you prefer to support your head and use one arm, that's fine. If you don't feel like lifting your head today, you keep it down. You can also roll your mat up and use it as a cushion. It's up to you. Okay, you're holding a position for 100 counts. I'll do the 100 counts. You breathe in for five and out for five throughout. Okay, coming up to your position. Hold. Let's pulse. Breathing in, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. In, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. In, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. In, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. In, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. In, two, three, four, five. Out, two, three, four, five. In two three four five, out two three four five. In two three four five, out two three four five. In two three four five, out two three four five. Bring those knees in. That's one hundred. Circle and circle the opposite way. Great work. Roll over onto your front. Okay. So far we've, doing, we've been doing forward flexion, now we're going to extend the spine the opposite way. So come up and stretch out on those elbows, or come up on the hands and give yourself a deeper stretch. Then come back down, all the way to the floor, drawing that navel up away from the mat still in neutral spine, and stretch out. Nice long stretch. Okay, bend your elbows, fingers under the chin. Now we're going to lift upper and lower body. So breathe in, lift. Breathe out, extend out to the sides. Breathe in, return, and out to lower. Breathe in, lift. Breathe out, extend to the sides. Breathe in and out lower. Keep it going. We've got one more of those. Come up, hold. Then bring the legs back in together, arms forward, stretch out and lower. Going into our swimming exercise, lift opposite arm and leg and lower. Swap sides, lift and lower. Now you can go a little bit quicker or you can go into that flutter kick. And hold, reach forward, legs out, breathe in, breathe out, circle the arms and bring the legs in. Breathe in and then out. Drawing the navel up towards the spine the whole time. One more. Reach forward and beat those heels. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one, stretch out and then come down. Excellent job. Now, keeping the legs on the floor for this one, we're going to take our arms to the side, like a capital E if you're looking down on yourself. Breathe in, lift your upper body, breathe out, reach forward, breathe in, return, and out, lower. Breathe in, lift, Breathe out, reach forward, breathe in and out. One more. Now keep the arms in that position. Breathe in, lift, breathe out, extend to the sides. Breathe in and breathe out. Keep that going. Keep that core engaged, protect your lower back. One more. 
and hold. Okay, breathe in. Then breathe out. Just roll up again, keeping your feet down. Hold at the top, breathe in. Breathe out, turn your head to one side. Breathe in, return. Breathe out, turn to the other side. Breathe in, return and out. Roll down, one vertebra at a time. And all the way down. Excellent. Okay, push up and sit back on your heels. Almost done now. Reach forward and stretch out. Walk your hands over to one side and stretch. Come back to centre. Walk to the other side and stretch. Come back to centre. Come up into a cat stretch. Then tuck the toes under. Push up. Hold, and then walk your feet into your hands, uncurl that body, slowly rolling up, and around to the front, just roll those shoulders back, roll forwards, shake it all out, stretch up, breathe in, and out. Come down one more time. Breathe in, reach up. And out, come down. One more shake out and give yourself a clap. Well done. Thank you for having me. Hoping to see you soon. Keep well. Bye for now.